Well, it is cold and blustery outside, but hotter than ever in here. Hi, everyone. It's Ian Drew here, senior editor from Us Weekly Magazine. And to my left. And this is Wale from Warner Brothers. My very special guest. He was, I wanted to intro myself how you did yours. And this is Wale from Warner Brothers and Maybach Records. OK. You could say it better than I can. I'm I just competitive like that. I'm yes, sorry. It's As you all were. right. It's all right. You have a right to be, especially listening to this genius new album, Ambition, his yeah. second disc. Mm -hmm. I love the first one. I appreciate this one's it. even better with everyone on it. Kid Cudi mm -hmm. and Neo. Rick Ross. And Rick Ross. And and Lloyd. Got, yeah, a little bit of everybody. And then I'm on there a couple of times, too. So. Yeah, you got a few verses. They, they, they let you do a few. <laughs> they let me. On your own the album. compilation, <laughs> the, the urban music compilation album that I'm, I'm featured on. Exactly. And it's not bad. It's but not bad. we got something else for you, too, that's very hot, our Hot Stuff segment. Uh, these are the top five sizzling stories from our new issue, right here on usmagazine.com. Let's get to it. Uh, first up, Lauren and Kyle's awkward reunion. It's been uh, a little bit of time. It's been a few months since Lauren Conrad broke up with Kyle Howard after three years together. But they got their groove on again this weekend at Voyeur at a Bing Svetka-sponsored Halloween bash. Apparently they were talking and Lauren was very flustered when she first saw him. Uh, but then they ended up catching up and then she moved on to flirt with Chase Crawford. And a source says he was staring at her while he was chatting with, uh, while she was chatting with Chase Crawford. Who's the source? And, and there, there are eyewitnesses everywhere. Wow. It's a party, come it's a on. Detail. That's a detailed story. There's a lot going a, on. liquor. Sponsored event. Well, you, you sober guess. sources was the was the source sober. I don't Crush know. It. I don't know. We have to do a breathalyzer. How sober are your sources? <laughs> and next, Lady Gaga smitten by her beau. You know uh, Lady Gaga quite well. I'm not well. familiar with you, her. They had a great hit. I love yeah. that song. Oh, yeah. you talking about the most famous Lady Gaga from Chilling? Yeah. Oh yeah, she didn't call me no more though. Well, maybe she will now. She's now smitten. that you're talking about her, she should be smitten. like, why are you talking about me? I'm smitten over her. Yeah. Well, a lot of people are, but in, in particular, Vampire Diaries' Taylor Kinney. They're dating now, but a source says she can't get too serious because of her 24-hour workload, and she can't really commit too much. But mm. she's really into him. And what does smitten very, mean? That means she she's really into him. She's oh, feeling him. Okay, cool. Yeah. She, not, she don't return my calls no more. Well, so. that's I'm kind of tight with you, Lady Gaga. Wow. You gotta, you know, I think we me. want a reunion. My number's here. still the same. And next, Tom Spinning Son, uh, DJ C Squared, who you might know as Connor Cruz. Tom's 16 year old son is, has a big DJ career going, and his father approves. Um, apparently, he's DJed not only his stepmom Katie Holmes's photo shoot recently, but also the Nick Halo Awards. And uh, we actually spoke to Connor, or DJ C Squared, and he said that Tom wholeheartedly approves. I'm all for it. Ambition is the key, you know. If that's what he wants to do, you know, I want to. My kids don't have to be rappers or anything like that. So I'm all for him, you know, aspiring to do the wiki wiki thing. Exactly. I'm all for that. Not Shout bad. out to C Squared, man. <laughs> Open checks in the mail. Go sign. <laughs> And next, Elizabetta's new man. I bet you're wondering who Elizabetta Canales is dating now, that she's over with George Clooney. Okay, I know George Clooney. I know George Clooney. Gorgeous Italian model, George. yeah. She's now dating McCad Brooks, okay. and it's apparently she's even calling him her boyfriend, and they jetted off to Berlin together. So it is a hot and steamy new romance for Elizabetta. Shout out to her. Enjoy the newness of that relationship. All these celebrities' love lives go so fast, you know? Yeah. I think they, 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 they meet today and then they go to Brazil Tuesday and Paris <laughs> and, you know, and they're on Perez Hilton together and they break up and they date each other's friends and they get back together at spec of reunions and have sources tell them about feelings <laughs> and all of that. Celebrities, man. I don't want any parts of this lifestyle. Yeah, I don't you gotta want stay part. out of that. I don't Just want any parts. Keep making music man. and, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. Rick Ross be, will tell you all about that. Yeah. We don't have time to get smitten. Yeah. We're just trying to get some money. Exactly. Young, ambitious man. Right. He knows. Well, we all know, finally, that Rachel Ray is a woman of many talents. Many, many talents. We, you've sp spoken to her husband. Yeah. Yep. yeah. He's told us about that, too. But uh, she, she cooks. She cleans. She interviews people. But she also... <laughs> Rides horses. You could see a picture of her filming her new show on horseback while in uh, Mexico. She was riding around everywhere. It's in this week's VIP scene. I could say something, but I'd rather not. All right. <laughs> And that's all the time we have love for this week, everyone. I'd like to thank our very special honored guest, Wale. Thanks for having me. Thank you for Appreciate coming. Appreciate everybody. Everybody. Yeah, everybody's they're, here. They're all looking. They're all. Appreciate you, yeah. universe. All right, pipe down, everyone. <laughs> and once again, I'm Ian Drew, senior editor here at Us Weekly Magazine. You can get these stories and much, much more all in our new issue on newsstands now.